liver lesion characterization. As a body imager, this is probably one of the more important uh, instances where I feel that I need contrast enhancement and why the ACR appropriateness criteria has deemed contrast enhanced MR usually appropriate in this situation. Because for example, when we look at our T2 weighted images, there is some information we can gather from T2 weighted hyperintensity. For instance, this lesion here has marked T2 hyperintensity that's like fluid, and so I feel comfortable calling this a cyst. However, when we get to hemangiomas, we have T2 hyperintensity. It's not the same as fluid. I, it's well defined. I still feel comfortable, but then we get into heterogeneous T2 hypointensity with other liver lesions, and when you get into the variable T2 intensity, I, I start to not be able to tell you what this lesion is. And it could be an adenoma, it could be hepatocellular carcinoma, it could be metastasis, it could be focal nodular hyperplasia. I can't tell you what this lesion is with, based on the T2 characteristics alone, unless it's markedly hyperintense, in which case then I can feel comfortable saying it's a cyst. Beyond marked T2 hyperintensity though, I. I cannot characterize lesions based on T2 weighted uh, information alone. So then we switch to our T1 weighted uh, sequences. Can I characterize lesions based on T1 hypotensity alone? No, it's nonspecific. You can have variable T1 hypointensity or uh, marked T1 hypointensity across all characterizations of lesions, be they benign or malignant. So we can't rely on T2 or T1 to help us for lesion uh, characterization. We can, with contrast though, get information about how these lesions behave relative to the surrounding liver parenchyma in multiple phases, particularly um, if it is, has neovascularity and is arterially enhancing, whether there's been portal vein uh, stripping um, in the portal venous phase, and then with our uh, um, lesions, I mean our uh, specific agents that have uh, hepatic, reten um, hepatic uh, excretion versus renal excretion, we can get an idea about uh, the hepatocyte containing lesions. So there is a lot more information to be gained from the administration of contrast. 